little bitty brown. Oh. Looks like a brown at least. Yeah, it's brown. He ain't quite big enough to net. We just Nice little 14 incher. Thanks, buddy. That's a better one. Yeah, that's a better one for sure. Beautiful. Come here, buddy. Oh, oh, he's not done yet. All right, here we go. Head up, come on. Oh, oh, he's going for the bank. Oh, I just picked another decent one. Oh, what a pretty brown. What a pretty brown. Beautiful. I guess he's gonna take me down the riffles. Oh, get around that. There we go. He's just like a lint noodle now. He's like, I'm done. I've had it. Come here, dude. Thank you. Not a bad one. Thank you, buddy. I want to keep him down here so he doesn't scare the rest of the fish up in that big hole. Oh, he's peeling line. Come on.
bigger it's still dink well that was pretty sweet it pulled i think like three out of that hole no hogs but still fish nonetheless um but yeah eh, i'll just show you guys what's been working for me literally the only thing and it's been the just the frenchy size 14 pheasant tail as you can see this one's all chewed up i'm gonna have to uh, switch it out right here but yeah I've been using a little just chubby Chernobyl, a golden one. I haven't had any action, but I've had luck here before about this time of year, catching a few on them. So I prefer that over an indicator. Um, yeah, I tried Rainbow Warrior, didn't have any luck with that. Tried a few other nymphs, but it seems like all they really care about is the chronic Frenchie. But yeah, that's about it, over and out. Just about 12 incher. It's weird. Last time I was here about two years ago, about the same time, the average fish seemed a lot bigger. I don't know if it's just the day it's been overfished or is it me? Probably me. I was hoping to get into some cuts. It seems like the browns run a lot of the cuts out of here. I've caught a few of them higher up by the dam, but I'm still couple miles from it so we'll see if I get into them Not much, but it's honest work, I'll tell you that. Yeah, they're not very big, but if you got a three-way rod, they are just an absolute blast. I mean, at this point, I'm just like nymphing. I mean, I've seen one rise the entire time I've been out here. I honestly haven't seen any bugs on the surface at all. It's been a pretty chilly, overcast day. I don't think it's above 50 right now. So, the old Lance Egan Frenchie will be your best friend in situations like this. But yeah, let's try to catch more. I feel like I've already caught like six out of this little hole. A sweet little golden stone.
Gotcha. Nice pretty brown. Thank you, Bubba. It's a beautiful one. Oh, get out of there. Oh, get out of there. Beautiful Colorado cut. Oh, shit. Oh, I got you. Thank you, Bubba. Hell yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you, buddy. All right, well, that does it for that stretch of river. Oh, what a pleasant surprise catching that cut. Oh my God. I love Colorado cuts, especially when they start turning red like that. It looks like they're pre-spawning right now. The water is frigid and I haven't seen many beds or anything that resembles cuts spawning down here so i think i'm gonna head up and see if i can get into some more of those because i don't want to mess with them once they start spawning honestly they're one of the few native fish out here and all the other rivers around here are just polluted with browns and i love browns don't get me wrong but they wreak havoc on the cuts and other native species so yeah we'll see how it goes can't ask for a better day Classic Utah, you got the red rocks, you got the pine trees, you got a little bit of snow on the other side. Oh, crystal green water. Yeah, lucky to be out. All right, well, that's it for this video. Yeah, I made my way upstream and it was completely blown out. And the bottom was like freaking gin clear. How does that make any sense? But yeah, I caught one on the dirty worm. Uh, and I'm proud to admit it. But um, yeah, that was it. Everything shut off after that. But um, yeah, thanks for um, watching. Please like and subscribe if you liked, and uh, we'll see you on the next adventure. Deuces.